Hey babies! So in today's video I'm gonna be working with this company it's called BS Show Hair. This is my second time working with them. They are an amazing, amazing company. So they sent me this straight hair. Um the hair is really good. Don't forget to follow them on social media by the way. So I'm gonna be showing you guys what the hair look like. So this is the hair. This is 26 inches. It came silky straight. As you guys can see, I'm gonna show you guys right here. It came with the clippings, of course. The clippings are very important. And it is also 180 density. So which means that it has a lot of volume. And yes. Don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. Subscribe. Thank you for 40k. Yay, I'm so happy. Okay, guys. The next day, I decided to cut the lace. Yeah. When you cut the lace, it doesn't have to be perfect, you know. Make sure there's not too much lace or too much of less lace. So, what I did was, I decided to go with a bolt hold glue. This is my first time working with this glue. To be honest, I was a little bit nervous because I don't know how the glue is going to work, how strong it was. But guys, don't forget to, you know, go check it out, the VS hair. Um, everything, like the link um the link to the hair to the website is gonna be under the description below and yes guys okay guys today i'm gonna be talking about also random stuff so how can a person stop being toxic do you guys believe that someone can be also toxic when it comes to friendship or family wise comment down below if you are think if you think you're toxic or the people around you are the one who are toxic guys you know i want to get to know you guys more i want you guys to get to know me more so we can have a strong bond and guys also comment why a lot of people in this generation are not getting married that's my question i want to know and yes oh wow voila so guys i went and i decided to dry the hair so I was a little bit nervous because I, I never work with this glue guys. I was like, oh my god. And I think this day, I think I had to go on a date. Guys, don't don't mind me. I'm just, I just woke up right now. It's like 9 o'clock. So my voice sounds like, man, or whatever. Okay, guys, I want to know how do you spot a fake friend? Like, how do you know when a person is a fake friend? And do you guys also feel like certain people try to use you guys in terms of what you guys have well what do you have because i feel like a lot of a lot of times in life people tend to use others but you really don't see that somebody's using you until somebody else tell you well back to work right now i'm just pressing you know the lace into into the glue you can use anything to press it down honestly i use my my edges brush right now i feel i feel like it was too white. I feel like the hair was too white, so I tried to apply with my foundation. As you guys can see right here, I applied my foundation and concealer because I feel like foundation would be too dark, concealer would be too light. So then, ba -ba 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 -ba, I decided to mix it or whatever. Okay, guys, yes, let's talk about random stuff, things that we don't talk about. Like, why do guys nowadays they always say, "Oh, let's go with the flow." Like, what does let's go with the flow really mean? Like, why do guys nowadays like to, to tell females, oh, I want a relationship in the future. And then, you know, in the middle of the talking stage, they'd be like, oh, I never told you that. Or they'd be like, oh, I'm not ready for a relationship. Like, oh my God. Guys, trust the process. Trust the process. Because honestly, when I was doing this hair, I felt like I had too much lace. I was so scared guys like but I was scared but I was so excited because I wanted to see how it was gonna turn out to be as you guys can see look at the scalp look how the scalp looks so natural electorally okay so guys right now I'm just cutting my edges as you guys can see boop you know swing squash yeah I'm just cutting my edges I didn't want it to be too long or too short, whatever the case was. I decided to use mousse, guys. I always use mousse. I don't know. I don't like using jam. 
I don't, I don't like putting oil in my wigs. I don't know why, but I just think like ugh, it gave me anxiety. Like putting, putting like too much gel. At least it's like edges control or something, but like putting oil in my wigs, I don't like that. Okay, so guys, yes, let's talk about. Do you guys believe that education is important? Like, do you think that we need education in order for us to live a better life? Because I feel like a lot of people be saying, oh, school is important, whatever, but a lot of people in our generation aren't even in school. And here I was struggling, yes. I was struggling, guys. I did this hairstyle like four or five times. I had so much anxiety doing this hair. Oh my god, guys. Don't forget to comment, you know, what hairstyle I should try next or what hair color I should try next. Guys, I'm so excited to show you guys a lot of projects that I have. Okay, right there? That's a no-no because I feel like as if I had, I had too much hair. Yeah, I was stressing. Look at my face, y'all. Yeah. I was stressing. Like, whenever my hair don't come right, I be stressing. But the good thing is that this company is really good. Like, the hair actually listens. You know. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Anyways, I don't want to talk too much. So, I'm going to just go and come back. Yeah, guys. I'm going to come back. Oh, no. I'm going to stay. So, I decided to use most again you know just to lay down um the part where i'm gonna do the ponytail this part i did it like five times like five damn times guys and the fact that i had nails i think it's harder to work when you have nails honestly because it's just there like oh you can't really do what you gotta do because you have nails whatever the case is but yeah guys look i did it oh we did it guys i was Okay, so guys, this is the final look. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to open the hair. Because I try to curl it, but I'm not really good at curling it. As you guys can see, this curl is more tighter than the other one. Which I think is weird. But yeah, guys, so this is the final look. I hope you guys like it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the website. I love the company. They have amazing hair. I mean, you guys should definitely go... Okay, so guys, this is, okay, so guys, this is the final look, as you guys can see. I love the hair. It was very easy to install. The hair came out bleached already, but I just wanted to bleach more just to, you know, to be more, to look more natural for my skin, that's all. And as you guys can see, this is what the frontal looks like. It's very easy to put it on, just put a little bit of foundation. And yes, um, the, the hair curls. As you guys can see, it, it could curl better if you know how to curl, but I don't know. So this is the best I got. Bye guys, don't forget to like and subscribe and check out VS Hair. I love them. They are one of the best company I know. Bye guys.